The high school football tour continues on as we are moving to stop number two of our 60 schools in 60 days marathon. Tonight, the, we preview the Vardaman Rams, a football program that ran in some tough times for the last two seasons. That was until last year when head coach Larry Gannon and the boys made a major step in the right direction, winning four more games than they had the previous two seasons. So what's the next step you may be asking? That's what drives the Rams for 2016. WCBI 60 Schools in 60 Days is brought to you by Toyota. Let's go places. And Emerson Animal Hospital in West Point. Building off how we finished last season, uh, managed to win four games, and the games we didn't win, we were in all of them but two. Uh, we had a good spring, attitude of the kids, the kids are excited, and uh, we're just looking forward to building another step of of getting back to where Vardaman football should be. Head coach Larry Gann got to see firsthand where Vardaman used to be back in the day. As he coached his Vardaman Rams in the early 80s, but in the span of 24 years, dating back to 1989, the Rams did not have a losing record. The program changed in 2013 and needed a major overhaul, which brought coach Gann back to Calhoun County to take over the Vardaman Rams football team once more. The hours of work and preparation paid off in 2015 as Vardaman won their first football game since 2012 this past season. Getting the wins and building off of a 4-7 and seven season is another step in the right direction. But that all started before the actual season began. It started actually last spring. We played pretty well against uh, Holly Springs, uh, Bahia, Potts Camp, and H.W. Byers in spring scrimmage. And, uh, that alone catapulted the off season, and uh, and then we we were competitive uh, early in the year, and just got a little confidence going, and and that seemed to make a lot of difference in attitude, and our kids didn't miss practice. It's the simple things with Coach Gann that make the difference, and simply put, he wants his Rams back in the postseason. Making a return to November football is closer than it may seem, but Gann wants to keep his kids focused throughout the season. Week to week, we just try to win the next ball game, but uh, our, our goal is to qualify for the playoffs this time. That's that's number one, and uh, and once you do that, then you know every week's a new week. So right now, that's our focus. The Rockus Rams will begin the 2016 season at home versus East Webster before taking their first road trip to see the Bruce Trojans to close out the month of August. In Vardaman on the high school football tour, Robbie Donahoe, WCBI Sports.